pissed off. Huh? Oh! <laughs> I didn't see you there. Hi, right, welcome to another episode of Poets Corner. I was just there making the Sunday roast, cooking, you know, something most women can't do nowadays. But that was, that was yesterday's episode. We talked about women and how they're upset. They're on a Facebook group. Today's a new day. We talk about new things. Today I want to talk about the road team. Why? Now, not everyone, because obviously some people's prerogatives and motives for being on a road team is maybe not something I can quite comprehend. But some people have no motive whatsoever, and for them people, I believe they're gay. Let me give you a little example why I think some people are gay. Some people are not, but some of the people on the road team are gay. And I'll tell you, what, I'll tell you why. Not everyone. I don't, I don't want to get beaten up walking to... Tesco's with my mom, or going to Sainsbury's with my mom, catch me in a quick save, or Morrison's, and I just get beat up, beat up trying to get some organic milk. It's not that. I'm not on this road thing. I'm just trying to be me. I'm just a nice guy. Look after the missus, I've got five kids. <laughs> but some men are gay. And I'll tell you why. Man, them will not go to the rave. You'll hear Stacy's there, sexy Stacy. And everyone loves her. Or you hear Shaniqua, you know them black names, Shaniqua. Shaniqua's in Coochie, what Shaniqua, Shaniqua? You mean Big Bay Shaniqua, mad man. Some man them still won't go. And you know Ben's at the rave, what, what Ben? Ben from, what, what Ben from down the road? You mean Turquoise gang? <laughs> man will go to see Ben in the rave. So they buck up with Ben, remember they brought their neck, you know, they look good for this rave. Man have to put on the Gucci, the Gucci hat and them thing there. The scarf, the belt, the Louis V. Just for Ben in the rave. So they brought their neck for Ben. Run up in the dance, now they see Ben, they sight Ben. Sexy Shaniqua's over there in the corner, you know. Shaniqua's going mad. She hit two funky house, she goes mad. Two bashment now, how about that for? Shaniqua's just mad, she just, she wants a little wine. But man are not constrained on Shaniqua, they want Ben. So this is why it's gay, because now Ben's coming to the rave. Man are broke in the neck to look at Ben. Screwing Ben. They barge Ben. They fight Ben. Now they've brought the neck for these men. Now more male bouncers are coming upstairs to take them out the rave. So this is more interaction with man. Then the feds come, and who predominantly are male. And they grab them and Ben. Now they're all going to prison. They're gonna be held on remand, where they go caught to be surrounded predominantly around more man. Now if they kill Ben in this rave, they're looking at a life sentence, and they'll go prison to spend time with who? More man! Now to me, that must be gay! Because if you broke your neck to see sexy Shaniqua in the corner, you might have gone home and got a little press. You might have caught something. Might have to go to the clinic and get some pills and butter it up, you know, because girls nowadays are burning. They're hot down there. Very hot. You're going to, eat, you're going to the clinic and you're catching things you can't even describe. But then man broke their neck for Ben. Wearing so many different colours bandanas, you don't even know where they are. Nowadays, when you go to the store, you feel, you feel like a bag of Skittles. You feel like you're watching a bag of Skittles where everyone's got a bandana. Grown man. I know, big grass man, 35, 7 kids. Running around with a bandana. How can I take that serious? Now I'm not saying everyone on this road thing is gay. Because like I said, when you see me in the little British home stores or Marks and Spencers with a grandma just trying to get them handkerchiefs for Father's Day man's not looking to try and I don't want to die I don't want to die but what I am saying is if you're not on the road thing to at least get some money what are you there for? because I know a lot of men a lot of men on this road thing broke broke big Gucci scarf Gucci this go to the go to the rave dry throat dry throat can't even get a water <laughs> A water. And we're not asking for no big thing. We're not asking for a crystal. We're asking for a two pound fifty water. Once they pay their ten pounds to get in, that's them, you know. You see them raving in the corner. What you? you no, no, I'm not even thirsty, you know. Man, sweating. No, I'm not even thirsty. I'm cool, you know. I'm easy. Now all I'm saying is, man, them. You might as well just jump off the road and get a nine to five. Make mummy proud. Go back to college, uni. Get a degree, something you can see. Don't come on the road thing, and then you're half-hearted. 
oh look, when I see them man, man know what time it is. Then you see them man, you don't do nothing. Do you know how much man, think about it, if everyone was on this team, do you know how much dead man there will be? There are different like crews with bandanas that are war on each other and no one's dead. No one's dead. And everyone claims they're on this team. You see the next video, listen, when man see them, they know what time it is. It, again, I don't even want to talk too much, <laughs> I just got I can't take it. No one's dead. I'm not saying I want anyone to be dead, but how serious is this thing? I say everyone just go church. Pick up a Bible. Better yet, forget Ben in the rave. Look for Shaniqua. Cause she's hot stuff right now. Anyway, I'm gonna go back to my cooking. That was Poet's Corner. Thank you. This stuff was just so nice. Oh, it's corner.